How you doing guys? This is Iris Dill and welcome back to my noisy workshop where I am currently I'm just sort of plowing through stuff trying to get to certain amounts of stuff. It's amazing. Right, so I we in my Discord we created this. This is a automatic belt saw that will keep cutting until you have got everything you want. I've seen people who have had to cut up massive stacks of shard bars because they've got like 20 or 30 different amounts of, you know, shards and they've got different chambers and they've got all this stuff everywhere and then they've got people who are cutting up different amounts of gold and different amounts of this. And it came to a conclusion that there's something that needs to be done about this but unfortunately there isn't really a way of doing it. But with the saw, there now is. Let me introduce you to the bandsaw. Now, the reason why we've set this up, and instead of putting it on my main line, which I do need a second saw, the second saw was mainly just to keep this automated. This is for mass production. So what I want to do is I want to take my shard one. So we're going to click this one. And that's all good. Excellent. So we've got this massive bar of shard, which is weighing in at 1,000 pounds. Now, okay, let's say I need to sit. I need to split this into ten different sh um, shard chambers. You know these things here. If I have to, sh if I have to cut ten of these up, I'm going to need a split equal. So if I go for a thousand pounds, so I want a hundred, right? So we're going to make we're going to make these. Excellent, fantastic. Let's just leave it on the conveyor belt. So every time it goes round, it's going to split off a one hundred bar. And then it's going to end up in this pot. And then it's going to split off another 100 bar. And that 100 bar is going to split off into this pot. And then it's going to do it. See? Amazing, isn't it? And this was one of the... We, when this saw was invented, I didn't realise how actually good this was going to be until we were sitting in my Discord going, this is actually a pretty cool idea. I don't think anybody's done it yet. So this is the automatic bandsaw. It will take everything you need, like a big massive bar of gold or anything else. And if you're looking to make loads and loads and loads of something, this is the way to do it. Even if I only ever use it for cutting shard bars, this is going to save me time and effort. And it's going to keep me happy because it means I'm cutting off everything I need it to do. And then it's all good. And it'll just keep going and going. And let's say I don't need, I don't want all of this stuff anymore. And I'm just sitting there just going, you know what, I don't really care. I've got all these bars. I don't really know what to do with it. How am I going to get this off of here? So the first thing I'll do is I'll take this, I'll take a belt out. And I'll just wait until it gets to the end. Excellent. All right. And then I'll just pop that back on my system. Now, if I've cut off too many and then I just want to put them all back on, what I will do is I'll just put them back on my conveyor belt because I could either let it go through the main line which will repeat all the way down to here and then I can just pop them on here and then they all go back onto my main belt and they all go through here and they should all end up in here like this there we go fantastic right and that is basically it so this thing here is going to save me time and effort this thing here is going to keep me going and I've got to be honest, having two saws and having all this done is just, it's a breath of fresh air, which means I don't have to sit there with a handsaw constantly cutting through blocks just to power up one booster chamber. And I'm all good with that. So if you if you want this design and this is how you build it. So let me just pop my, let me, let me just saw back over there. So you want the saw to sit in the middle of a line. So it, all, so it does a, a group of six belts and you all want, you want them all to just cause a loop. The actual saw is going to face outwards. So so that's where that conveyor belt is going to be. Under here, the pipeline is pretty simple. So what we've got here is we have got one pipe going into here, splitting into two lines. So the other cork that's empty lined is there. So we've got a line that comes up here and we've put a cork in it here. This line follows this pipe around and then we've corked up the middle one as well. So there's no leaks and it's all good. And I know I keep saying all good, all good, all good, but at the end of the day, this just makes perfect sense to have a little machine like this working so you don't have to do a lot of cutting. And that just means it's all good. So let me I'm just gonna pop this back up here. I'm gonna put my keypad back in here. And then when I get a new one, I'm gonna chuck another saw in the middle, and then we're fine. And then that just means that this will keep cutting, this will keep working, 
this will never run out because it hasn't got any other move it hasn't got any boosters or machines attached to it and i'm just going to have two lots of automation which is pretty much what i wanted in the first place the reason why i needed two lots is because one was for mainly cutting off massive amounts of stuff so if i want to make like if i want all my boosters charged i can use this to cut all them all down or if I just want uh, my line to be automated and I want everything to be coming off at one point, then this is the way I'm going to do it. So this is going to come through here, that will spit off over there, and then I'll catch it in a bucket over here. And then I've got the exact measurements I need for specific quests. So this is going to be my quest saw, this is going to be my band saw for doing whatever else I do. Apart from that, it's all good. Hopefully this helps you out, and hopefully you can invent this... Well, this... Ho Hopefully you can use this machine as for yourselves as well. It ju it's just a time saver, and it cuts, and it's good. And uh, you got to be honest, once you've used it, it's um, you don't really have to worry about it ever again. It just works, and it's all good. It's good. So thank you very much for coming by. If you want to watch another one, there's a video coming up on the screen right now. I'll see you, catch you later. A boom, fist bump to you.